And more cautious when reading about COVID on Twitter. Be extra cautious when you're looking for health information in the Twitter verse. The company drops its COVID misinformation policy. Twitter has dropped its COVID-19 misinformation policy. Be cautious while looking for health information in the Twitter verse. Be extra cautious while looking for health information in the Twitter verse. Be extra cautious while looking for health information in the Twitter verse. Be extra cautious while looking for health information in the Twitter verse. Be extra cautious while looking for for health information on the Twitterverse. Be extra cautious while looking for health information on the Twitterverse. Be extra cautious while looking for health information in the Twitterverse. Be extra cautious while looking for health information on Twitter. Be extra cautious while looking at health information on Twitter. Be extra cautious while looking for health information on Twitter. Be extra cautious while looking for health information on Twitter. Be extra cautious while you're looking for health information on Twitter. Be extra cautious while looking for health information on Twitter. Is relying on the same sources, even using the same phrases. I mean, think of it. There are literally thousands of legitimate news stories that could be reported in a given day and an infinite number of ways to report them. When everybody's on the same page, it might be the result of an organized campaign. Hi, I'm Fox San Antonio's Jessica Headley. And I'm Ryan Wolf. Our, our greatest, greatest responsibility, responsibility is, is to, to serve, serve our, our Treasure Valley communities. The El Paso Las Cruces communities. Eastern Iowa communities. Mid-Michigan communities. We are extremely proud of the quality, balanced journalism that CBS4 News produces. But we are concerned about someone trying to be responsible one-sided news stories plaguing our country. Plaguing our country. The sharing of biased and false news has become all too common on social media. Moral alarming some media outlets publish the same fake stories without checking facts first the sharing of biased and false, false news has, has become, become all too common, common on, on social, social media, media. more alarming some media Unfortunately, some members of the media use their platforms to push their own personal bias and agenda to control exactly what people think. And this is extremely dangerous to our democracy. 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 Good Morning America is brought to you by Pfizer. CBS Health Watch sponsored by Pfizer. Anderson Cooper 360. Brought to you by Pfizer. ABC News Nightline. Brought to you by Pfizer. Making a difference. Brought to you by Pfizer. CNN Tonight. Brought to you by Pfizer. Early start. Brought to you by Pfizer. Friday night on Aaron Burnett out front. Brought to you by Pfizer. This week with George Stephanopoulos is brought to you by Pfizer. This weather report brought to you by Pfizer. Today's countdown to the royal wedding is brought to you by Pfizer. And now a CBS Sports update brought to you by Pfizer. Meet the Press data download brought to you by Pfizer. This portion of CBS This Morning sponsored by Pfizer. On how to find the hidden sugars in the American family diet. Sponsored by Pfizer.